Hello! If you want to learn Japanese quickly and easily without any classroom time or book studying, then you've come to the right place. Let's start talking right now. Hello, I'm Kerwin. And I'm Blaine. And we're your hosts of the Easy Go Japanese channel, where you'll learn some simple and easy Japanese short words and phrases so you can start speaking Japanese right now. Hello, and welcome to another video in the new series called Holidays in Japan. In this series, we'll be sharing with you some history and traditions observed throughout the year during various Japanese holidays and observances, along with some key words and phrases popular for those occasions. In this episode, we'll be talking about Christmas in Japan. As everyone knows, Christmas is a holiday that celebrates the birth of Jesus Christ. In Japan, this holiday is not a major event, but does not have any religious association. Christmas has become a popular celebration in Japan, even though less than 1% of the Japanese are Christian. However, Christmas is not a family time in Japan. In fact, it's not even a national holiday. December 23rd, though, is a holiday because it is the birth of the present emperor. Most Japanese work on Christmas Day just like any other day. Gift exchanges take place between couples and companies, corporate offices are sometimes decorated for the occasion. Parties with Christmas themes often lead up to the big Shogatsu New Year celebration. So how do the Japanese celebrate Christmas? It is a time for lovers to have romantic dinners and give presents, much like St. Valentine's Day. The media now really push Christmas Eve as being a time for romance. That's why Christmas Eve is more important in Japan than Christmas Day itself. Fancy restaurants and hotels are often booked solid at this time. In December, Christmas classics are played everywhere. Most popular Japanese Christmas songs are for lovers. Here are a few fun facts for you. So do you know what the most famous Japanese Christmas song is? Mmm, mm, not offhand. Uh, it's gonna be Christmas Eve by Tatsuro Yamashita. <sighs> it's really popular because the lyrics speak of lovers unable to meet on Christmas Eve. There's a couple of links below to the song and to the lyrics translated in both languages. Check them out and let us know what you think. How did the song make you feel? Do you know what the Japanese eat for Christmas dinner? Mm, can't say I do. <laughs> mm. The answer is chicken, especially Kentucky Fried Chicken. The Japanese adopted the celebration of Christmas from the West, but previously there were not many customs associated with it besides presents and a special Christmas cake. In 1974, KFC started advertising chicken for Christmas. The idea came from a foreigner saying that he only eats chicken on Christmas Eve because turkey was hard to find. It is quite rare that a company's advertising campaign is so successful that it becomes a Japanese custom. Japan is the only country in which KFC offers set meals for Christmas. The most popular item is called the party barrel which includes chicken, a salad, and a cake. Even though it has to be ordered in advance, the stores still get long lines around Christmas. Check below in the comments section for links to a Christmas KFC menu. It'll be both Japanese and English. If you load the Japanese page, there'll be a slideshow, and then you can see the special Christmas meal. Your last one will be, when was the first Christmas recorded in Japan? Hmm, I don't know that either. Well, the first one was in Christmas in Japan was a mass held by Jesuit missionaries in Yamaguchi Prefecture in 1552. Hmm. Some believe that unrecorded celebrations were held way before the state starting in 1549 when St. Francis Xavier arrived in Japan. So it seems I've been around for quite a while now. So before we wrap up this episode, we want to share some Japanese Christmas words and traditions. So our first word will be Merry Christmas. To say Merry Christmas, it will just be pronounced Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Hmm. Our next word will be Christmas Day, and that'll be pronounced Christmas no he. Christmas no he. Our next one will be Christmas tree, which will be Christmas no ki. Christmas no ki. The next word will be fireplace. And that's pronounced Donro. Our next one's gonna be decoration, which will be Soshoku. Soshoku. Mm 
Hmm, let's see, we got fireplace, and decorations. How about Belle? And that'll be Suzu. Belle, Suzu. All right, our next one will be present, which will either be presento for present or omiyage for gift. So presento or omiyage. And the last word we have for you will be Santa Claus. And that'll be pronounced Santa San. Santa Claus, Santa San. As far as traditions or traditional things that go on in Japan, we'll start with the Japanese Christmas cake. The Japanese Christmas cake, or Christmasu keiki, is sold on practically every street corner from Hokkaido to Kyushu. This dessert is light and spongy with whipped cream filling and frosting topped with perfectly cut deep red strawberries. Next, we have winter illuminations. The entire country goes crazy for illuminations. Shopping malls, restaurants, and public areas have the most incredible display of lights that you can imagine. And they're all there for passerby to get really into the Christmas spirit. And our next one will be Japanese Christmas markets. From the north to the south, Japan hosts typical Christmas markets from the beginning to the end of winter season. While visiting Japan at this time, you'll be able to find everything from delicate tree ornaments to mold wine. Last, but by no means the least of the festivities, we have the Disney Christmas Spectacular. At Tokyo Disneyland, both international and local guests are able to enjoy a special event called the Christmas Fantasy which is themed from the storybooks filled with Disney characters. This event offers guests a happy and fantastic Disney-style Christmas with fireworks, special merchandise, candy giveaways, and a special Christmas meal. Well, what'd you think of today's episode? Did you learn anything new? If you're in a country other than the US, how do you celebrate Christmas? Please tell us in the comment section. We'd love to hear from you. If this is your first time here, please click the subscribe button and then the bell so that you don't miss a single episode. If you're a returning subscriber, we want to thank you for supporting us and this channel. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas. Mata Rainen. Mata Rainen.